Hello, hello, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to, going to be building 40358 Bean, Bean There Donut That, a Target exclusive from, I believe, 2019. So, today is a set I've already built, but we will be rebuilding it for you guys. And without further ado, here we go.
Hey, and welcome to the review portion. So, I've decided to change it up to more of a less of a strict a strict kind of review process and the more of what I like and do not like in the sets. And along with this, uh, we'll give it just this overall grade in the end because of it. So now let's, but I will obviously point out specific things like minifigures and pieces, obviously, because they do stand out and they are a important thing to, in my opinion, to the sets. Now with further ado, let's move on. So let's start with the minifigures themselves. So I, I've kind of, I've kind of just put them uh, throughout the, throughout the cell, er, bleh, <laughs> throughout the space itself. We have a businessman. Um, he's very plain. He is back printing on the torso. Printing on the front, um, one facial expression, I believe. I believe they all have one uh, facial expression. I believe that's mostly how it is with the city sets. Just roll up my sleeve here. <laughs> uh, then we have a doctor with a cellular phone. And all of the little pieces are printed in this set, which is very nice. I, I like that indeed. Just has a little biscuit, I believe. Be a scone. Get a little Dalmatian. Uh, not a minifigure, but an animal itself. <laughs> Behind the counter is a little barista. Again, with the unisex uh, torso piece which is very delightful indeed no name tag so you can use it with any oops, with any full focus any scene which I very much enjoy and then in front of the counter we have a construction worker Back print and, and everything. He has a little mustache. Cute. Um. Now that's all for the minifigures. There is a little bicycle with a helmet and a garbage can. I like how the set is just a bunch of small little little uh, side things with the like side builds with the main build. Like the little sign is very cute. I like it. And the little table, the little bicycle is very nice as well. And then for the main build, we have this little cart, this little coffee stand, coffee and biscuit stand. It has this rotating. Foods. <laughs> this rotating little food tray, food dispenser, which is very nice. I like that. I believe you're going to have to take off the, the lid if you want to get out any biscuits, but there's nothing really in there other than uh, a donut, and then all the rest are just plain colored tiles. It's nice with all the pieces in general. The set is very nice with all the pieces. Oops, I kind of messed up the... Little coffee drip machine. I've never heard of a coffee stand where people serve themselves with coffee. I mean, actually, I'm wrong. That that is that is wrong. If it's if it's a uh, coffee in a pot or in like a little uh, dispenser, <laughs> my bad. Um, but overall, I like the build. It's very quaint. It's very cute. These little side pieces come out. Uh. Oops. These little side pieces come out. As more 
counter space, so that's very nice. Um, overall, the piece comes with many printed uh, pieces, which is very nice. Um, that is actually that like I I've, I I excuse me. I very much enjoy that because I will probably be using this set, and I probably do, or I probably will be buying another set at some point, um, just to get more of the little bakery pieces. I would love to have a full pie. <laughs> that'd, that'd be very nice. Um, and just the minifigures themselves are very nice generic pieces, along with the barista. It'd be nice to have two baristas. Uh, even though I do have one from the Newberry uh, juice bar set, and yeah, that that it's pretty much that with the set. It's very just like sparse, but also just nice with all the side builds. I do enjoy that this set has a lot of side builds compared to a lot of other sets where it's just the one build and then kind of not really too much side builds. Uh, the Newberry Juice Bar didn't have any side builds. And I think they were about the same amount of pieces. Uh, yeah, 20 pieces, 20 pieces different. And I mean, the fact though is that the Newberry Juice Bar said, I believe you can play with it and all of that. But, and then it, it also has the second like like haunted feature though it would have been nice to get maybe a little sign i do very much enjoy the little sign <laughs> but beyond that uh it's very it, i for for a here, scratch that <laughs> for a target exclusive set i i enjoy it very much um, I believe, I, I think it would be very cool if Lego did more, uh, exclusive sets with different companies, especially distributors of Legos. Though, my one thing is, I wish it was more Target related. That's, that's the one thing that got me. It's that only at Target, and so obviously, yes, it's a Target exclusive, and they do have target exclusive sets that you can only really get at target and then lego.com itself but i i have thinking i think it's kind of disappointing uh to the fact that it's it doesn't even say lego city on it so it's it's just its own like this is a target exclusive set so i feel like it should be it would be cool if it was a target thing a target themed thing maybe little pop out thing of cl uh, of a clothing store or something I, I i don't know but it would have been cool so other than that <laughs> i i do enjoy the set very much all in all i believe the set is an overall buy for how much it is the age related or the age that's related to seven plus it's a good build for that age even with the small builds it makes it where they can build the sign first and then take a break if they for some reason don't have the attention span to finish a full set um and i mean there's nothing wrong with that it it it's totally it's totally a thing um some people get bored really quick but it's i feel like a good way to get kids into the set into Legos if you want to get your kids into Legos especially with how colorful and interesting it is um, by the time they finish the uh, sign and then the table and then they get to the front and the, obviously the trash can and the bike when they get to the ju the stand the, the like coffee stand itself I think it's a very enjoyable and then for adults in general or whoever to buy this, uh, I also think it's a nice set. I think it's nice for the pieces itself. Um, they're all printed. So, and also you get a little dollar and a nice little phone. I think it's just an overall nice set and worth the buy. And that'll be all. Have a nice one.